it's nice to be back. It's a great place as a, as a technical surveyor with a, of interest and to be back here and see all the new toys on the market. And uh, of course, we're here at, uh, at the Navis booth. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of toys out there today. And uh, some years back, it was all flying. Uh, at the moment, it's all more handheld or wearable. Uh, scanning uh, devices and um, I guess it's a uh, it's a very interesting way uh, basically uh, based on uh, a lot of our jobs anyway is based on uh, of surveying a uh, lot uh, square meter buildings mainly uh, building for uh, for reconstruction yeah uh, redesign and uh, we've uh, find, found that the VLX is very useful outdoors actually we've we've scanned a lot of square meters for detailed surveys so combined with uh, a lot of control points, uh, we found that the accuracy is, um, is very uh, doable for us, uh, very useful. We've been in the scanning business for 20 years and we've used, we've got the uh, geoslammers, we got terrestrial scanners, and then we got the VLX. Um, we always combined it with, uh, I mean, old fashioned um, survey technique, I guess, the, the total station. The total station is the basis of all surveys done and uh yeah the horizon is uh is not defined on, until you have had a total station in your data oh certainly uh more and more agile uh better accuracy uh, smaller boxes i guess uh that's what that's what we want isn't it um i guess uh the nav has found the the golden egg these years with the first uh, set of really good scanners uh, and on a very um variable and handy device so but yeah the trend is uh flying and moving scan as you go